Kansas City is going to be involved in the creation of a show. We're, we're a character in the show. We're going to help mold what the formula for this new show will be. And I think that's extremely exciting. And that's very Kansas City. I mean, we are collaborative, we are creative, we are hardworking, we're welcoming, and all of that is going to be a part of this very new show. I was in Kansas City for, I think, maybe eight hours, and I felt like I had come home. It's a wonderful, wonderful place to come and shoot because it just gets our crew and our cast so involved in the city itself because they feel like they're part of it. And that, to me, when you're dealing with where you're gonna do a location for a movie or a television show is 90% of it. We're so fortunate that that's able to happen, that we don't have to bring everyone in from LA, but instead our teams can be made of locals who know what they're doing here, who bring top-notch expertise in all the, all the departments and allow us to be able to make the show on time and on budget here in Kansas City. This is terrible, but how much can you have? This is just too much. I get tired just of looking at it. The new television series, the first season of which is filming in Kansas City, uh, is called The Gentle Art of Swedish Death Cleaning. One day when you're not around anymore, uh, your family would have to take care of all that stuff. And um, I don't think that's fair, really. If somebody were to pass away, all of a sudden, your loved ones, in their moments of the worst grief, have to also deal with all of your things. For months, <laughs> we were wondering what was gonna happen and I would check in with uh, our friends at Scout. No news, but no bad news. No news, but no bad news. This went on for a little while. And then one day, uh, a stranger knocked on my door and uh, when I opened it, she handed me um, a bottle of champagne and a note card and it said, we can't wait to see you in person, underlined, underlined. Your friends at Scout Productions.